Oh my gosh. Okay, y'all. So this is going to be my fitness journey postpartum. Um, these past couple years have been a whirlwind for everybody, especially for me, because not only did COVID hit, but I got pregnant in the midst of it, um, which was somewhat planned, but it happened. Things changed. Um, my body changed. I got way out of whack. And since then, I've been trying to figure out how to get a regular workout routine back into my schedule with a baby, um, plus getting better eating habits and things like that. Um, I have not worked out in over a year. I haven't worked out since September 2020, like in a gym setting, and it's now December of 2021. And I'm not going to wait till January for this New Year's resolution to get this going. I'm just going to go for it. I'm ready. Um, and today, seven months postpartum, I am going to the gym for the first time. Uh, so I'm excited. I don't know how it's going to be. I don't know what I'm going to feel like doing. Um, but we're going to go for it. Um, and I want to take you guys along on the journey so that if you're in the same spot that I am, or if you're about to be, if you have been, we can relate and you can go through it with me. And um, I think it'll be a good thing for me to have this video and for everybody else. So let's do this. All right, so I put a little bit of makeup on, I fixed my hair, and I'm not gonna lie, I do have a little bit of social anxiety um, just now, but you know, I know I'll get over it. I just need to get into the gym. Um, if you can't tell, my face looks kind of rough. Um, and honestly, it's because I've been eating nonstop crap, um, chocolate, desserts, you know, we've had Thanksgiving and then we're about to have Christmas now. So it's just, you know, and plus it's cold outside. So my skin is drier than normal and things are just out of whack. But I did still put a little bit of makeup on just because I want to feel like a put together person before I go to the gym. And it's just kind of, kind of make me feel better. I think, um, a lot of times I do wear makeup to the gym cause it does make me feel better. Um, so yeah, that's what I did. And I'm nervous for my first workout. It may be nothing. I may just like hang out on the treadmill for an hour. I don't know, but, um, yeah, you guys, this is going to be tough. And it's also going to be tough vlogging this because I've never vlogged. I have vlogged in public before, but not by myself. So we'll see how that goes. All right, I'm here at the gym and I'm sitting in my car. Y'all already know what's happening. A little social anxiety, I'm not going to lie. Um, Because this time of day, especially, the gym gets really, really full. But it's the only time of day that I have um, because of my babysitter schedule. So hopefully I will have some room to exercise. Um, and I don't know, I may just end up staying on the treadmill today. I'm not really sure. I just want to do something. Like I just want to get something in. Um, so I don't know if I'm going to take my phone in because I am not one to ever take my phone in the gym with me. Um, I never have before just because it's very distracting. Um, so I always just leave it in the car, put it in my locker, but, uh, I may take it in there for the purpose of this video. And, and now that I have a child, I kind of need to have my phone with me all the time. Um, and I don't have an Apple watch or anything like that. So there's no other way to really communicate with my babysitter if I need to so um yeah I'll probably just take my phone in there and maybe get a little vlogging I'm not sure how that goes um but yeah so here we go okay so I just got in from my workout and it actually was not that bad I did 30 minutes of cardio which I absolutely hate, but that was the only thing I did today for the first workout. Um, so I did 30 minutes on the treadmill, which was an incline. So I did 10 minutes incline and then I did 
like one minute running, which I hate running, so I didn't do a lot of that. Um, and then the rest of the time I just fast paced walked. Um, so all in all, it was a pretty good workout and I'm glad that I went. Um, I definitely, it was weird being back after so long. Um, there was a bunch of people in there because it's a Monday night and apparently Monday nights are very um, full, but it was still worth it to at least get some cardio in. So hopefully I can come back tomorrow evening and that'll be my second workout. And I'm not sure what I want to do yet, but I will uh, figure that out later. I'm hoping that eventually if I can get some footage inside the gym of me actually like working out so that y'all are like this girl is completely lying about what she's doing. Um, hopefully I can get some like footage inside the gym eventually um, but we'll see because like I said it was very packed and I know like people get weird around cameras when you bring them in public places they don't want to be on camera or they just like stop and stare and make fun of you so that part I'm gonna have to get over I guess but um yeah so eventually I'll do that but so first day went well and um I'm gonna continue this vlog on to tomorrow okay so it is a post-workout and I had to go by this place that is right from my gym it's called Ketchup Creek and I ended up getting a chicken sa chicken salad sandwich and it was probably one of the best I've ever had um a place I've heard really good reviews about it so I just hopped over next door because it's literally next door to my gym and checked it out um pretty good place it seemed like they have a lot of um healthier choices I'm not gonna say they're quite the healthiest but they are healthier choices for you anyways um, instead of going to Dario that's right next to it and getting something that's terrible for you. Um, so yeah, I would say the first gym night was a success and I'm super proud of myself for going to the gym and getting at least three minute cardio workout. It's better than nothing. Um, even if you start with a 10 minute workout, you should be proud of yourself because it's not always easy. Okay, you guys, so it is day two, which means it's Tuesday, and I am going to go to the gym this afternoon again. Um, I don't know if I said it earlier in the video, but I am only going to do this twice a week right now because that's pretty much all the time I have. Um, but, oh well, I woke up this morning and I had twice as much energy as I did yesterday, which was interesting because you know it, like I said last night I only got 30 minutes of cardio but I feel like I have a lot more energy um I actually got up earlier this morning um I need to go eat some lunch because it's like 12 o'clock now and I haven't had anything since I've woke up um but I think I'm gonna go to the grocery store and get some sushi uh something better for you than what I probably have in my refrigerator right now or my pantry um because I have not got groceries so it's pretty much just junk that's left um so I, yeah I'm gonna go to the grocery store get something healthier um and just wanted to point out my face today you can see I usually don't have a problem with acne I never have but especially this time of year when I'm laying around eating a lot, eating a lot of junk food, that's when my acne really, really starts to come out. So it's, it's coming out and, um, I'm sticking strictly to water right now. So I think, um, by me, like drinking a lot of water and stuff, these toxins are just pushing their way out of my body right now. And so I'm having a lot of like acne breakouts and stuff. And since I've had my son, um, I've been breaking out on my legs and just all over my body. Um, and that may have something to do with hormones. I have no clue. But um, regardless, I am on a fast track to put good things into my body. And yeah, so I will get back to this video later in the day when I'm about to go to the gym. 
Okay, well, I decided to cut in the video. Um, so, I'm actually, since I'm going out, I was going to show you what I'm wearing. Um, I'm wearing my John Deere sweatshirt. And to match the green on the sweatshirt, I decided to wear my WSI Sports socks. Check them. Check them. Yes. You can see the acne on my legs I was talking about. Um, but these socks, they are actually thermal socks and they're, um, made from a company in Egan, Minnesota. Um, they're called WSS Sports and I follow them on Instagram. Um, probably some of the best thermal wear I've ever, ever experienced. Um, I hunt a lot or at least I have in the past. So WSS Sports is what I've always wore underneath my hunting gear because it's like the best ever. Um. And so I have a lot of socks, like leggings. Um, I have some shirts, some gloves, some headwear. Like I have a whole nine yards because they have a really, really quality fabric. Um, and they also make a lot of thermal wear for like big sports teams across the United States. And so it's pretty cool. Uh, you should check them out. I will definitely leave a link in this video so that you can. Um, and yeah, I'm about to head to the grocery store. Hey girl, hey girl. Oh, here comes Fran and there's the cat. <laughs> Did you have a good nap? Huh, Did you have a good nap? Oh my gosh, you guys, I just bought a crap ton of sushi and I'm so excited. I bought too much, but I'm gonna eat it for supper too, so. <laughs> Holy crap, y'all. So I was just coming back from getting my sushi and all of a sudden the power went out um, all throughout the town. So there were no stoplights working and people were wrecking like left and right. And I witnessed the wreck. It was awful. Um, but I'm glad like we got out of there in time because there's, there's a lot of stoplights there and a lot of big four ways. So people were just going chaotic. But yeah, I don't know what happened, but the power just went out. Something. I just hope that by the time I go to the gym this afternoon, that I won't have to like deal with it. <gasps> oh, fingers crossed. Kitty not, there was like so many people in the gym. I did not get a chance to do the um, exercise equipment things, <laughs> whatever, that I wanted to do. So. Oh, well, we'll shoot for next week, but it seems like I picked the busiest days to go to the gym, so that part sucks, but um, we'll shoot for next week, and hopefully it'll be better, and I can get a better workout in. Not that I didn't get a good workout in this time. I feel like I got a pretty good workout in um, and got some sweat on, but it just wasn't my normal, like, two-hour heavy working out. Mm, yeah. I know you've not seen any gym content yet, but I swear I went and I earned this. Like, I earned this. Public special tempered shrimp. Holy cow. Yeah, it's got fried onions on it. Who cares? Okay? It's good. It's really good. Um, but anyways. Um, I'm back from the gym. We're gonna get a bath. Go to bed and then I will see you guys next week. Stay tuned. Hopefully I can get a more interesting video up. Um and actually some gym content. We'll see. We'll see. But yeah, right now I'm gonna go tend to my child and thank you guys for watching. Say bye bye bye.